An art series launched in southern Indiana is meant to shine a light on black communities, to highlight their contributions and to help them heal during this time. The final touches on the first piece of art. It's a mural right here in the Claysburg neighborhood of Jeffersonville, and it went up today. Southern Indiana reporter Abby Lutz is showing us this message behind the brushstrokes. There's not much to see in front of the old Spring Hill Elementary School, but step to the side and you'll see a different story. This mural is responding to some of the, the hardship of the time and trying to reverse that. This is the first piece in an art series called Soulful Nourishment. Jeffersonville Public Art Commissioner Kofi Darku got a grant for the project through the Next Narrative for Black America campaign. The Next Narrative is emphasizing that there has been a narrative before where we have not been featured positively, so now we are taking ownership and creating that Next Narrative. For this piece, it's a collaboration of community ideas. By collecting the neighborhood's ideas, we are literally taking their voice, putting it on the, the wall, and it's an authentic black voice in a, in a black space that's empowering and helping us advance that next narrative of the future that we want that we want to be so much more promising and bright. A future of growth and strength. Those are themes played out in the mural, and it's tucked right next to the community garden, which Darku hopes will get noticed a bit more now. Artist Casey Jackson has spent just seven days creating this mural. I like this one um, just because of the, the culture behind it and like the diversity it has in it. So, I mean, most of my projects is usually just beautification projects, which is, you know, something nice. But uh, this one here it really speaks to the community. It represents the community. And this is just the beginning. We're looking to have artwork that helps us heal. We're looking to have artwork that helps uh, commemorate history that hasn't really been highlighted in a Southern Indiana history. And we're also looking to think of the future, start to envision what we want our communities to be. I'm looking to explore this in other cities beyond Louisville, Jeffersonville. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that we can create, uh, be a catalyst for this type of positive growth. In Claysburg, Abby Lutz, WHAS 11 News.